ಸಂಸ್ಥಿತೆ ತೇಜಸ್ವಿನಾವಧೇತಮಸ್ತು ಮಾ ವಿದ್ವಿಷಾವಹೈ ಓಂ ಶಾಂತಿ 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 ಓಂ ಗುರುರ್ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಗುರುರ್ವಿಷ್ಣು ಗುರುರ್ದೇವೋ ಮಹೇಶ್ವರ ಗುರು ಸಾಕ್ಷಾತ್ ಪರಂ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ತಸ್ಮೈ ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರವೇ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಸಚ್ಚಿದಾನಂದರೋಬಾಯ ವಿಶ್ವೋತ್ಪತ್ತಿ ಹೇತವೆ ತಾಪತ್ರಯ ವಿನಾಶಾಯ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣಾ ವಯನ್ ನುಮಃ ಜನ್ಮಾದ್ಯಸ್ಯತೋನ್ವಯಾಧಿತರತಶ್ಚ ಅರ್ಥೇಶ್ವಿಘ್ನಸ್ವರಾಟ ತೇನೇ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಹೃದ ಆದಿ ಕವೇ ಮುಹ್ಯಂತಿ ಯತ್ ಸೂರಯ ತೇಜೋವಾರಿ ಮೃದ ವಿನಿಮಯೋ ಯತ್ರಸರ್ಗೋ ಮೃಷಾ ಧಾಮ್ನಾ ಸ್ವೇನ ಸದಾ ನಿರಸ್ತಕುಹಕ ಸತ್ಯಂ ಪರಂ ಧೀಮಹಿ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರಂಚ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವೀಂ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತೋ ಜಯ ಮುದೀರೇತ್ ಓಂ ನಮೋ ಭಗವತೆ ವಾಸುದೇವಾಯ ಓಂ ಯೋಂತ ಪ್ರವಿಶ್ಯ ಮಮ ವಾಚ ಮಿಮಾಂ ಪ್ರಸುಪ್ತ ಸಂಜೀವಯತ್ಯಖಿಲಶಕ್ತಿಧರ ಸ್ವಧಾಂ ಅನ್ಯಾನ್ ಸಹಸ್ತಚರಣ ಶ್ರವಣ ತ್ವಗಾದೀನ ಪ್ರಾಣಾನ್ ನಮೋ ಭಗವತೆ ಪುರುಷಾಯ ತುಭ್ಯಂ ಸಮಸ್ತ ದೇವತಾಭ್ಯೋ ಋಷಿಭ್ಯೋ ಮುನಿಭ್ಯೋ ಗುರುಭ್ಯೋ ಬ್ರಾಹ್ಮಣೇಭ್ಯೋ ಆಚಾರ್ಯೇಭ್ಯೋ ಭಕ್ತೇಭ್ಯೋ ಸಾಧುಭ್ಯೋ ಸಾಧಕೇಭ್ಯೋ ತೀರ್ಥೇಭ್ಯೋ ಕ್ಷೇತ್ರೇಭ್ಯೋ ನದಿ ನದೇಭ್ಯೋ ಶಾಸ್ತ್ರೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಸಮಸ್ತ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮವಿದ್ಯಾ ಆಚಾರ್ಯೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮಃ ಶ್ರೀಮದ್ಭಾಗವತ ಮಹಾಪುರಾಣ ಆಚಾರ್ಯೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮಃ ಪರಬ್ರಹ್ಮಣೆ ಮಹಾವಿಷ್ಣುವೇ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಣೆ ಸನಕಾದಿ ಮುನಿಭ್ಯೋ ನಾರದಾಯ ವೇದವ್ಯಾಸಾಯ ಶುಕಬ್ರಹ್ಮರ್ಷಿ ಸುಮತ ಮಹಾಮುನಿಯ ಶೌನಕಾದ್ರಿಶಿಭ್ಯ ತ್ರಿಯಾದ್ರಿಶಿಭ್ಯೋ ಪ್ರಹ್ಲಾದಾದಿ ಭಕ್ತಜನೇಭ್ಯೋ ಆದಿತ್ಯಾದಿ ನವಗ್ರಹ ದೇವತಾಭ್ಯೋ ನಮಃ ಮಾತಾ ಪಿತೃದೇವತಾಭ್ಯೋ ನಮಃ ಅಸ್ಮದ್ಗುರುಭ್ಯೋ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ಯೋಂತ ಪ್ರವಿಶ್ಯ ಮವಾಚ ವಿಮಾಂ ಪ್ರಸುಪ್ತ ಸಂಜೀವಯತ್ಯ ಕೃಶಕ್ತಿಧರ ಸ್ವಾಂನ ಅನ್ಯಾನ್ ಶಾಸ್ತ್ರಚರಣ ಶ್ರವಣತ್ವಗಾದೀನ್ ಪ್ರಾಣ ನಮೋ ಭಗವತೆ ಪುರುಷಾಯ ತುಭ್ಯಂ ಓಂ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಪರಬ್ರಹ್ಮಣಿ ನಮಃ ಓಂ ನಮೋ ಭಗವತೆ ವಾಸುದೇವಾಯ ಶ್ರೀಮದ್ ಭಾಗವತ ಮಹಾಪುರಾಣ ಏಕಾದಶ ಸ್ಕಂಧ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ಹಿತ್ವಾನ್ಯಥಾರೂಪಂ ಸ್ವರೂಪೇಣ ವ್ಯವಸ್ಥಿ ಅಥ ಷಡ್ವಿಂಶೋಧ್ಯಾಯ ಶ್ರೀ ಭಗವಾನ್ ಉಚ ಪದ ಥರ್ಟೀನ್ತ್ ಸ್ವಾರ್ಥ ಸೋ ವಿಧಂ ಧಿಂ ಮಾಂ ಮೂರ್ಖಂ ಪಂಡಿತ ಮಾನಿನಂ ಯೋಹಮೇಶ್ವರ ತಾಂ ಪ್ರಾಪ್ಯ ಸ್ತ್ರೀಭಿರ್ಗೋಖರವಜ್ಜಿದ ಸೇವತೋ ವರ್ಷ ಪೂಗಾನ್ ಮೇ ಪೂರ್ವಶ್ಯಾಧರ ಅಧರಾಸವಂ ನ ತೃಪ್ಯತಿ ಆತ್ಮಭೂ ಕಾಮ ವಹ್ನಿ ರಾಹುತಿಭಿರ್ಯಥ ಪುಂಶಲ್ಯಾಪಹೃತ ಚಿತ್ತ ಕೋನ್ವನ್ಯೋ ಮೋಚಿತು ಪ್ರಭು ಆತ್ಮ ರಾಮೇಶ್ವರ ಋತೆ ಭಗವಂತ ಅಧೋಕ್ಷಜ ಬೋಧಿತ ದೇವ್ಯಾ ಮೇ ಸೂಕ್ತವಾಕ್ಯನ ದುರ್ಮತೆ ಮನೋಗತೋ ಮಹಾಮೋಹ ನಾಪಯತಿ ಅಜಿತಾತ್ಮನ ಇಮೆ ತಯಾನೋಪಕೃತ ರಜ್ವಾವಾಸರ್ವಚೇತ ರಜ್ಜೋ ಸ್ವರೂಪ ವಿದುಷಃ ಯೋಹಂ ಯದ್ ಅಜಿತೇಂದ್ರಿಯ ಕ್ವಾಯಂ ಮಲೀಮಸಃ ಕಾಯ ದೌರ್ಗಂಧ್ಯಾಧ್ಯಾತ್ಮಕೋ ಶುಚಿ ಕ್ವಗುಣಾ ಸೌ ಮನಸ್ಯಾಧ್ಯಾಸೋ ಅವಿದ್ಯೆಯ ಕೃತ ಪಿತ್ರೋಹ ಕಂ ಸ್ವನು ಭಾರ್ಯ ಸ್ವಾಮಿನೋಗ್ನೇಹೇಶ್ವಗ್ರುಧ್ರಯೋ ಇಮಾತ್ಮನ ಕಂ ಸುಹೃದ ಯೋ ನಾವಸೇದೆ ತಸ್ಮಿನ್ ಕಳೇವರೆ ಅಮೇಧ್ಯೆ ತುಚ್ಛ ನಿಷ್ಠೆ ವಿಸಜ್ಜತೆ ಅಹೋ ಸುಭದ್ರಂ ಸುನಸ ಸುಸ್ಮಿದ ಮುಖಂ ಸ್ತ್ರಿಯ ಪಂಗ್ಮಾಂ ಸರುಧಿರ ಸ್ನಾಯು ಮೇಧೋ ಮಜ್ಜಾಸ್ತಿ ಸಂಹತೌ ವಿಣ್ಮೋತ್ರ ಪೂಯೇ ರಮತ ಕ್ರಿಮೀಣ ಕಿಯದಂತರಂ ಅಥಾಪಿ ನೋಪಸಜ್ಜೇತ ಸ್ತ್ರೀಷು ಸ್ತ್ರೈಣೇಶು ಚಾರ್ಥವಿತ ವಿಷಯೇಂದ್ರಿಯ ಸಂಯೋಗಾತ್ ಮನಃ ಕ್ಷುಭ್ಯತಿ ನಾನ್ಯಥ 
ಅದೃಷ್ಟಾದ್ ಅಶ್ರುತಾತ್ ಭಾವಾದ್ ನ ಭಾವ ಉಪಜಾಯತೆ ಅಸಂಪ್ರಯುಂಜತ ಪ್ರಾಣಾನ್ ಶಾಮ್ಯತೆ ಸ್ಥಿತ ಮನಃ ತಸ್ಮಾತ್ ಸಂಗೋ ನ ಕರ್ತವ್ಯ ಸ್ತ್ರೀಷು ಸ್ತ್ರೈಣೇಶು ಚೇಂದ್ರಿಯ ವಿದುಷಾಂ ಚಾಪ್ಯ ವಿಸ್ರಬ್ಧ ಷಡ್ವರ್ಗ ಕಿಮು ಮಾದೃಶ ಶ್ರೀ ಭಗವಾನುವಾಚ ಏವಂ ಪ್ರಗಾಯನ ನೃಪದೇವ ದೇವ ಸ ಊರ್ವಶೀ ಲೋಕಮಥೋ ವಿಹಾಯ ಆತ್ಮನಮಾತ್ಮನ್ಯವಗಮ್ಯ ಮಾಂ ವೈ ಉಪಾರಮಜ್ಞಾನವಿಧೂತ ಮೋಹ ತಥೋ ದುಸ್ಸಂಗಮುತ್ಸೃಜ್ಯ ಸತ್ಸು ಸಜ್ಜೇತ ಬುದ್ಧಿಮಾನ್ ಸಂತ ಏತ ಚಿಂದಿ ಮನೋ ವ್ಯಾಸಂಗ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ಸಂತೋನಪೇಕ್ಷಾಮಚ್ಚಿತ್ತ ಪ್ರಶಾಂತ ಸಮದರ್ಶಿನ ನಿರ್ವಮಾರಹಂಕಾರ ನಿರ್ದ್ವಂದ್ವಾ ನಿಷ್ಪರಿಗ್ರಹ ತು ನಿತ್ಯ ಮಹಾಭಾಗ ಮಹಾಭಾಗೇಶು ಮತ್ಕಥಾ ಸಂಭವಂತ ಹಿತಾನೃಣ ಜುಷತಾಂ ಪ್ರಮುನಂತ್ಯಘಂ ತಾಯೇ ಶೃಣ್ವಂತಿ ಗಾಯಂತೆ ಯನುಮೋದಂತಿ ಚಾದೃತ ಮತ್ಪರಾ ಶ್ರದ್ಧಾನಶ್ಚ ಭಕ್ತಿ ವಿಂದಂತಿ ತೇ ಮಯಿ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಲಬ್ಧವತ ಸಾಧೋ ಕಿಮನ್ಯದವಶಿಷ್ಯತೆ ಮಯಿ ಅನಂತ ಗುಣೆ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಣಿ ಆನಂದಾನುಭವಾತ್ಮನಿ ಯಥೋಪಶ್ರಯಮಸ ಭಗವಂತ ವಿಭಾವಸು ಶೀತಂ ಭಯಂ ತಮೋಪ್ಯೇತಿ ಸಾಧೂನ್ ಸಂಸೇವತಸ್ತ ನಿಮಜ್ಯೋನ್ಮಜ್ಜತಾಂ ಘೋರೆ ಭವಾಬ್ಧೌ ಪರಮಾಯನ ಸಂತೋ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮವಿಧ ಶಾಂತ ನೌರುದೃಢೇವಾಪ್ಸು ಮಜ್ಜತಾಂ ಅನ್ನಂ ಹಿ ಪ್ರಾಣಿ ಪ್ರಾಣ ಆರ್ತಾಂ ಶರಣಂತ್ವ ಧರ್ಮೋ ವಿತ್ತ ಋಣ ಪ್ರೇತ್ಯ ಸಂತೋರ್ವಾಭ್ಯತೋರಣ ಸಂತೋ ದಿಶಂತಿ ಚಕ್ಷೋಂಶಿ ಬಹಿರರ್ಕ ಸಮುತ್ಥಿ ದೇವತಾಂಧವ ಸಂತ ಸಂತ ಆತ್ಮೇವ ವೈತಸೇನಸ್ತೋಪ್ಯೇವ ಉರ್ವಶ್ಯ ಲೋಕ ನಿಸ್ಪೃಹ ಮುಕ್ತ ಸಂಗೋ ಮಹಿಮೇ ತಾಂ ಆತ್ಮಾರಾಮಶ್ಚಾರ ಇದೆ ಶ್ರೀಮದ್ಭಾಗವತೆ ಮಹಾಪುರಾಣೆ ಪಾರಮಹಂಸ್ಯಾಂ ಸಂಹಿತಾಂ ಏಕಾದಶ ಸ್ಕಂಧೆ ಷಡ್ವಿಂಶೋಧ್ಯಾ ಓಂ ಶಾಂತಿ 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 ಓಂ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಶರಣ ಮಮ ಶ್ರೀಭಾಗವತ ಶರಣ ಮಮ ಶ್ರೀಸದ್ಗುರು ಶರಣ ಮಮ ಶ್ರೀ ಸೋತ ಶರಣ ಮಮ ಶ್ರೀ ಶುಕದೇವ ಶರಣ ಮಮ ಶ್ರೀ ವ್ಯಾಸ ಶರಣ ಮಮ ಶ್ರೀ ನಾರದ ಶರಣ ಮಮ ಶ್ರೀ ಕುಮಾರ ಶರಣ ಮಮ ಶ್ರೀ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಶರಣ ಮಮ ಶ್ರೀ ವಿಷ್ಣು ಶರಣ ಮಮ ಶ್ರೀ ಪರಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಶರಣ ಮಮ ಶ್ರೀ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಶರಣ ಮಮ ಶರಣ ಮಮ ಶರಣ ಮಮ ಶ್ರೀ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಗೋವಿಂದ ಹರೆ ಮುರಾರೆ ಹೇ ನಾಥ ನಾರಾಯಣ ವಾಸುದೇವ ಶ್ರೀ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಗೋವಿಂದ ಹರೆ ಮುರಾರೆ ಹೇ ನಾಥ ನಾರಾಯಣ ವಾಸುದೇವ ಶ್ರೀ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಗೋವಿಂದ ಹರೆ ಮುರಾರೆ ಶ್ರೀ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಗೋವಿಂದ ಹರೆ ಮುರಾರೆ ಹೇ ನಾಥ ನಾರಾಯಣ ವಾಸುದೇವ ಹೇ ನಾಥ ನಾರಾಯಣ ವಾಸುದೇವ ಹೇ ನಾಥ ನಾರಾಯಣ ವಾಸುದೇವ ಮೂಕಂ ಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲ ಅಂಗು ಲಂಘಯತೆ ಗಿರಿಂ ಯತ್ಕೃಪಾತಮಹಂ ವಂದೇ ಪರಮಾನಂದ ಮಾಧವ ಸ್ವರ್ಗೆ ಸತ್ಯೇ ಚ ಕೈಲಾಸೆ ವೈಕುಂಠೆ ನಾಸ್ತೆ ರಸ ಅತಃ ಪಿಬಂಧು ಸದ್ಭಾಗ್ಯ ಮಾಮುಂಚತ ಕರ್ಹಿ ಚಿತ ಓಂ ನಮೋ ಭಗವತೆ ವಾಸುದೇವಾಯ ಓಂ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಪರಬ್ರಹ್ಮಣೆ ನಮಃ ಶ್ರೀಮದ್ಭಾಗವತ ಮಹಾಪುರಾಣ ಏಕಾದಶ ಸ್ಕಂಧ ಮುಕ್ತಿರ್ಹಿತ್ವಾನ್ಯಥಾರೂಪಂ 
स्वरूपेण व्यवस्थित अथ षड्विशोध्याय श्री भगवाच ऐलवाच सैल्यूटिंग टू एंटायर भागवताचार्य परंपरा गुरु परंपरा नॉन देवता भक्ता साधक प्रेइंग टू ऑल ऑफ देम टू गिव अस दि एबिलिटी टू क्विकली स्टडी अंडरस्टैंड शास्त्र रीच टू द अल्टीमेट एंड बिकम द इंस्ट्रूमेंट्स इन द हैंड्स ऑफ द लॉर्ड फॉर ब्लेसिंग नॉट वी द लॉर्ड फॉर ब्लेसिंग गाइडिंग ऑल द जीवास ऑन टू द पाथ ऑफ परफेक्शन अबाउट भागवत स्वर्गे सत्ये च कैलासे वैकुंठे न अस्ति अयम रस अयम रस दिस भागवत रस इज नॉट अवेलेबल इवन इन द ग्रेटेस्ट ऑफ दि फोर लोकास द स्वर्ग ऑफ इंद्र दि सत्य लोक ऑफ ब्रह्मदेव कैलास ऑफ दि लॉर्ड शिव वैकुंठ ऑफ दि विष्णु इट इज अवेलेबल ओनली इन भूगोल भूलोक अतः देर फोर पिबंत ड्रिंक इट सद्भाग्या If you are fortunate, you drink, and this fortune is by choice. If you drink, you are so fortunate because we get the Bhagavad Gita Bhava Mukti, and never ever, ma ma muncha ta karhichit, never ever for any reason leave or go away from this Bhagavad Gita Rasa Aswadanam, because it is Vibhut Bhagavatam Rasam Alayam Mohuraho Rasiga. It is the such a rasa. as well as rasayana not only it removes all the bhava roga diseases but also it gives the joy of living the joy of living is fulfillment the fulfillment is only in discovering the paramatma in and around that great like the body not only should not have the diseases but it should be healthy giving us joy when i look back and live my entire life i had gone through every disease every now and then how painful would be that memory on the other hand i lived 80 90 years but none of the diseases came up so healthy how joyful would be that at the body level in the same way when we do the bhagavat rasa pana saswadana there will be congratulation to ourselves by ourselves celebration to ourselves because we lived a fulfilled life or we made our life fulfilled or the life given as an opportunity is made fruitful by us the greatest achievement is possible through bhagavata dhyanam bhagavata rasa aswadanam which is available only in the bhumata bharata mata in the india in the human life only not in swarga satya kailasa vaikuntha see the greatness of this shastra Study it, and you and I have less doubts regarding this because we have spent more than two years. Wherein we are going on seeing from every skanda beautiful stories, wonderful stories, one after the other coming to empower us in all aspects of human life as well as divine life. It only we committing to ourselves that let me digest the shastra gnana, let me live that life, let me experience it. it is only this committed efforts of ours which will truly make us fulfilled otherwise the information wise if you see by the study we have come to know what is said in this shloka is 100% perfect that we get that rasa aswadana which is otherwise not available in any other way in any other loka so thus let's thank our own fortune let's thank puja gurudev for pushing us towards this let's thank all the rishikuni parampara for choosing us or giving us an opportunity not because of us but in spite of us see they only let them bless us with all the medhas pranotu that we are serious sincere in a grasping every aspect of the shastra and for our own fulfillment let us use it now among those beautiful topics hundreds of them nowadays we are studying the pururava upakhyanam of 11th skandhas bhagwan krishna is telling uddhava in this mukti skandha how to analyze our experiences and other experiences and get detachment from 
all the binding involvements of ours in the world namely the maya the prakriti trigunas the vastus the vyaktis the temporary tatkalika sukha bhoga this is the topic that is under discussion then once we do through that when we get dissociated with them how we have to embark on the path of realization through the satsang that would be told to us by lord krishna in the coming shlokas now experiences are analyzed and the mistakes within ourselves are analyzed and come to the facts you know the investigation team sit you know those are both are hote na anti corruption wale cid crime investigation so we are doing all that to find what's going wrong and where it's going wrong and who is doing wrong so what's going wrong is our delusion where is it going wrong is in our own self who is doing it ourselves only so as we were talking 3 4 days back if you look into the topic that is being discussed is what it is the mind which projects it is the mind be attentive to its own projection it attributes value clear to the value attributed thing the mind only creates desire once the mind creates the desire about its own projection which it values like anybody you and i when we buy something value something or uh, like something we don't allow others to take away our liking of that if somebody does it uh, we become too emotional in the same way after creating desire for something which it named as real which is its own projection uh, the next weapon the mind uses is uh, the weapon of uh, emotions most worst thing in human life is the emotions and sentiments to our own projections and the funniest part of our life is what those things which liberate us towards that we are ruthless rational logical without any love emotions or love and liking and to the destroying things knowingly also we have the uh, the sentiments and emotions because of which we are not able to live what makes us bound to urvashi is nothing but our own sentimental emotion when even after knowing that she is cause of all dukha therefore the higher intellect has to come into the picture which has got the data from the shastras which speaks about satya asatya nitya anitya and that should educate the mind if the mind is ready to educated if not kick the mind along with its opinion and this intellect should form its own group its own party its own symbol and it should collect uh, contest and it should win the election <laughs> in our inner psycho intellectual politics if good party if a group doesn't stand or create a good party with good manifesto and uh, do the publicity of it get votes and power from the public and rules the nation the nation will never grow in the same way in our own life if the good party called as the intellect doesn't stand and win the election and protect our own adhyatmika jivanam or our life from falling we will not be able to be helping ourselves so here pururama was got caught up sentimentally emotionally along with all earlier things urva she is real she is the source of sukar anandam therefore i am attached to her i have desire for her and uh, later on he came to know that uh, she is not permanent she live and go at that time the dukha was so unbearable he tried his best to go with her he tried his best to stop her both were impossible at that junction is the intellect started working wherein he sang the song of analyzing his own experiences and uh, coming to that beautiful understanding of detachment and dispassion which is very essential very healthy so that is what we were seeing so in the mantra 13 one of the very important topic 
very exhaustively we discussed yesterday only one aspect of that we'll share today again swarthasya akovidam what is good for me what is ultimate for me to reach what i am given this opportunity as human life where should i go if this is not known with what whatever other abilities talents achievements we have still we are pandita mani but not pandita we are murkha only and to such as dhikkar ho that's what intellect is given yet not used to understand thoroughly what is the ultimate goal to be reached there itself the first step itself we got failed then the entire human life with other resources of the mana the indriyas the deha the people around us the prakriti around us the gurus around us the bhagavat krupa how will we use all of them to reach the ultimate goal because first step only we did mistake of not knowing with our intellect what is the ultimate goal mera swa artha kis mein hai conversely when the swa artha is not known what is in what is my good all that because of which i will be definitely getting bad to that i give value which is not swartha that's anartha and all the resources i use for that rather misuse for that and get destroyed no after getting destruction or suffering any one you blame nobody will take the blame even if somebody takes blame or not we are suffering why should we go through it they were committing mistakes and not learning from those mistakes is the worst thing the best thing is never to commit mistakes even if it happens let us learn from them not to commit again so swarthasya akovidam dhingmam murkham panditamani nam how quiet mind say is shloka with the artha we have to chant and feel about it about ourselves we only have wasted our entire life not knowing in what is our good or great and think we know everything and behave murkhata se dikkar ho and remember it is not that last 60 50 70 years i lived like that no every day we have to think every day in the morning we have to think uh, what is the artha i have to fulfill today only that we have to conduct uh, toward the end of night end of the day look back and see did i fulfill my swa artha did i do something regarding my own evolution or have i wasted my life in the anartha considering myself with a pandita if yes i am murkha and that day of my is dikkara day is the unit of life every day how we live is what we live in our entire life therefore set to the day and involve entire day only in the mukti giving sadhanas never ever even for emotion or obligation sake uh, uh, what i say contradict this particular thought never ever talk again as to this thought even for any obligation or sentiment don't try to talk otherwise than this point the moment we compromise immediately the whole day schedule will be worldly if the day schedule is worldly whole life is worldly har din humko jeetna hai tabhi jaakar zindagi ko hum jeette hain aur har din ka har ek ek ghanta humko jeetna hai and what is jeetna there every ounce of energy of the senses body mind every moment of the time only for parartha swartha parartha swartha not anartha not anartha did my mind take lots name did my intellect think about paramatma did my karmendriyas did seva to the lord upasana today this is how moment by moment we have to feel and plan do in such a way that there is no need of any question as to did i did i there is no need of answer yes or no because so much i am involved in that in that way only the jeevas jeeva bhava along with the causes of jeeva bhava the upadis merge in the paramatma paramatma anubhuti comes there is no other way may we be fully convinced about this point as immediate as possible
ಎಲ್ಸ್ ಸ್ವಾರ್ಥ ಯಾಕೋ ವಿಧಂ ಥಿಕ್ ಮಾಂ ಮೂರ್ಖಂ ಪಂಡಿತ ಮಾನಿನಮ್ ದೇನ ಯೋ ಹ ಅಹಂ ಈಶ್ವರತಾಂ ಪ್ರಾಪ್ಯ ಇದು ಈಶ್ವರತಾಂ ಪ್ರಾಪ್ಯ ಇಸ್ ಅನದ ವೆರಿ ವೆರಿ ಎಕ್ಸೆನ್ಷಿಯಲ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ಎಸ್ ಟೆಡೆ ಡೇ ಬಿಫೋರ್ ವಿ ಡಿಡ್ ನಾಟ್ ಡಿಸ್ಕಸ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಮಚ್ ಬಟ್ ಟುಡೇ ವಿಲ್ ಡಿಸ್ಕಸ್ ಕಿ ಆಸ್ ಅ ಹ್ಯೂಮನ್ ಬೀಂಗ್ ಹೂ ಈಸ್ ದ ಬೆಸ್ಟ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ರೆಷನ್ ಆಸ್ ವೆಲ್ ಆಸ್ ಎ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟೇಟಿವ್ ಆಫ್ ಪರಮಾತ್ಮ ಈವನ್ ವಿತೌಟ್ ಸೀಕಿಂಗ್ ಆರ್ ಎಂಡ್ ಟ್ರೈಯಿಂಗ್ ವಿ ಅಟೆಂಟಿವ್ ಆಲ್ ಸೋ ಮೆನಿ ಫ್ಯಾಕಲ್ಟೀಸ್ ದಟ್ ಆರ್ ಗಿವೆನ್ ಟು ಅರ್ಸ್ ದೇ ದೆಮ್ ಸೆಲ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಸಫಿಷಿಯಂಟ್ ಫಾರ್ ಅರ್ಸ್ ಟು ರೀಚ್ ಹೈಯರ್ ಇಫ್ ಎಟ್ ಆಲ್ ಎನಿ ಸ್ಪೆಷಲ್ ಎಬಿಲಿಟೀಸ್ ಕೆಪ್ಯಾಸಿಟೀಸ್ ಆರ್ ರಿಕ್ವೈರ್ಡ್ ಫಾರ್ ಅವರ್ ಹೈಯರ್ ಪರ್ಸ್ಯೂಡ್ಸ್ ಆಸ್ ಎ ಹ್ಯೂಮನ್ ಬೀಯಿಂಗ್ ವಿ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಡೂ ದೋಸ್ ಟೈಪ್ ಆಫ್ ಇನ್ವೋಕೇಶನ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಸಾಧನಾಸ್ ವಿತ್ ವಿಚ್ ಎವ್ರಿ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಪಾಸಿಬಿಲಿಟಿ ಎವ್ರಿ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಎಬಿಲಿಟಿ ಎವ್ರಿ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಟ್ಯಾಲೆಂಟ್ ಎವ್ರಿ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಪವರ್ ವಿ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಗೈನ್ ಟು ರೀಚ್ ಆಸ್ ಬಿಗ್ ಆಸ್ ದ ಗೋಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಈವನ್ ಗಾಡ್ ಆಲ್ ದಟ್ ಪುಟ್ ಟುಗೆದರ್ ಈಸ್ ವಿ ಆರ್ ಈಶ್ವರ you know to get out of the clutches of urvashi to get into the higher and greater goals and to achieve whatever is required all are with every human being that is naturally given by the lord to them is only has to recognize it make use of it if at all some are lacking the paramatma is there in the form of the gurus etc they guide us so here in the case of pururava ಈಶ್ವರತಾಂ ಪ್ರಾಪ್ಯ ಈಸ್ ಹಿಸ್ ಈಶ್ವರತ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಕಿಂಗ್ಡಮ್ ಈಸ್ ಅ ಸಮ್ರಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಚಕ್ರವರ್ತಿ ಈಸ್ ನರದೇವ ಶಿಖಾಮಣಿ ಈಸ್ ಔಟರ್ ಈಶ್ವರತ ವಿದ್ ಇನ್ ಅಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ಅಸ್ ಆಸ್ ಅ ಸಾಧಕ ನೆವರ್ ಎವರ್ ಇಮ್ಯಾಜಿನ್ ದಾಟ್ ಐ ಡೋಂಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಸಫಿಷಿಯಂಟ್ ಎನಿ ಸಾರ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಗ್ರಾಸ್ ಆರ್ ಸಟ್ಲರ್ ರಿಸೋರ್ಸಸ್ ಟು ಕಮ್ ಔಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಮೈ ವೀಕ್ನೆಸಸ್ ಆರ್ ಟು ಗೆಟ್ ಇನ್ ಟು ದ ಹೈಯರ್ ದ ಥಾಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಸೆಲ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಕಾಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಅವರ್ ನಾಟ್ ಟ್ರೈಯಿಂಗ್ and not putting all our abilities into function this is what arjuna was doing in gita he was an ishvara with that thought he came kair maya sah yodhavyam asmin rana samudhyame such an ishvara when he saw the people both sides he said yadi maam apradigaram ashastram shastra paneh dartarashtarane anyo then make shemataram he became so suicidal anybody can kill me with their arrow i am again pausing for us to understand cut let us become conscious about the ishwaratva that lord has given to everyone even to us also with which a sky is not the limit anything we can reach then elaborate this topic a little bit he is that in the world everybody is destroying themselves or failing themselves in life like us or are there great achievers there are great achievers in all fields especially spiritual if they have achieved what do they have because of it they have achieved and do we have those things or not if you look into we also have the same things ದೇವರ್ ಏಕ್ ಬಂದೇ ಕೋ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ಮಿಲಾ ಪ್ರಯತ್ನ ಸೇ ತೋ ಸಬಕೋ ಮಿಲ್ ಸಕತಾ ಹೈ ಸಬಕೋ ಮಿಲೇಗಾ ತೋ ಮುಜೆ ಭೀ ಮಿಲೇಗಾ ಔರ್ ಉಸಕೆ ಲೇ ಜೋ ಭೀ ಶಕ್ತಿಯಾ ಹೈ ರಿಮೆಂಬರ್ ಆಲ್ ಆಫ್ ದೇಮ್ ಆರ್ देयर ಇನ್ ಮೀ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ದಿ ವಿವೇಕ ಶಕ್ತಿ ಇನ್ ಮೀ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಹೌ ಟು ಇನ್ವೋಕ್ ಇಟ್ ವೆನ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಇನ್ವೋಕ್ಡ್ ದ ವೈರಾಗ್ಯ ಕಮ್ಸ್ ಟು ಮೀ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ದ ವೈರಾಗ್ಯ ಶಕ್ತಿ ಇನ್ ಮೀ ವೆನ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಬ್ರಾಟ್ ಔಟ್ ವಿತ್ ವಿವೇಕ ಐ ವಿಲ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ದ ಪವರ್ ಟು ಕಂಟ್ರೋಲ್ ಮೈ senses and mind called shamadama when i invoke the shamadama which is within me the uparamati tiksha shaddar easily possible when these are done by me the mumukshuta it is possible i am ishvara i can do that i am ishvara ishvara is not lordship here in this explanation ishvara is the capability i have capacity to go to guru in the ashrama i have the ability to stay there i have all the strengths etc to do what he says and i have all my maturities to discuss with him ask him from him get the upadesha about the highest goal and the means in and through this from what i am now to where i have to reach to achieve all that whatever the shakti samarthya required all of them are with me this feeling is called as ishvara everyone has focus on that point now in the case of what happened to pururava and all of us also is what do ishwaratam prapya but we have given 
undue importance to something uh, which totally takes away or makes our ishwaratva misused or non used and we fall to his level what was his level stri bhir go karavat jitah being the here the ishwaratva means we can chalk out our destiny we can reach out our destiny instead of chalking out reaching out the higher and greater destinies we have become such a way stri bhi go karavat jitah we are con- conquered by the, she, he, in his case conquered by the woman like the donkey and other animals are uh, mastered by the humans and they make them dance to their tunes in the same way in our life also to the prakriti anything lesser than the intellect intellect should be always under the guidance of shastra and sadguru anything other than less namely the mana indriya deha if we allow them to jito as a win as a we and pururava same go karavat jitah it's not emotion sentiment that should make us live our life it is not the sense organs and perceptions of the shabda sparsha should decide our life it is not body is bhoga shakti or nidra shakti or tama guna it is intellect that should chalk out ki i am the jeeva i am given this apparatus to use for sadhana and reach bhagwan not to get entangled in them not to get bound by them not to get enslaved by them not to destroy my glorious opportunity by involving in them this is how again and again antar mathana the more number of times the more number of deeply we do the more in the beginning the visha adi comes om visham shivaya samarpayami give that visha to shiva continue that mathanam churning then the amruta of the convictions the amruta of the courages the amruta of the commitments the amrutatva of all the invocation of the powers all the strategies all the plannings initiatives and consistently walking on the path in spite of all the inherent obstacles that great joy of living and doing will be ours this is what pururava missed now he is doing we also have missed let's do it uh, taking him as an example it was his life he recognized it he sold out that life for that urvashi and became a beggar in our case also it is our life it is we who have to make it richer than the richest not beggar see yasho jane sani swaha shreyan vasya soni swaha vasya soha sani swaha what a beautiful is the commitment मेरा जिंदगी बाबा कहाँ फंस रहा हूँ कहाँ गिर रहा हूँ कब तक कौन है बचाने वाला खुद मदद करो तो सबका बदल हेल्प मिलेगा नहीं तो नहीं सो स्वार्थ सेवा कोविदम दिंग माम मूर्खम पंडित मान नम ईश्वरत्व अनुप्राप्य यो हम ईश्वर तम प्राप्य स्त्री भीर भो करवत जिता हा तो एनी थिंग अदर देन परमात्मा प्राप्ति और प्रयत्नम इज स्त्री इज उर्वशी दैट इज नॉट बी enslaved by them by becoming the donkey or bull or buffalo or gada or kutta in front of them that they order and we do what they say no every moment it is how can the excessive sleep how can the mind ask our aadha ghanta so jay how can the mind ask let me go and watch this and that how can the mind say let me indulge in and bhoga and even if it says what happened to my intellect sharam nahi aata how do you listen to that the external example of this is all friends your children grandchildren everybody ask you dada ji khelne chalte hai ghumne chalte hai na hasne chalte hai khane chalte hai kutte ki tarah dhum ulke ulke piche jate hai hum what about sadhana one after the other people or things of the world are enslaving us no freedom at all we are and we think we are pandita murakh hai hum ya likha hai swasth roop se <laughs> davan who doesn't recognize zero ishwaratva the one who doesn't use his intellect to decide for himself where is his own artha and the one who doesn't employ all his ability for that he thinks is pandita but is a murkha his life is go karavat jitah like a life of a donkey and other things which have no freedom independence at all this is what we have to conscious careful and what thought we discussed today in the beginning 
keep in mind with all the wisdom etc still we lose the battle we have one thing called as sentiments and emotions that's why gurudev says emotions are the beauty of the life emotionalism is emotionalism is the scar of the life life is a comedy to those who think the wise people life is a tragedy to those who feel emotional see show love give love if they receive good if they not doing nataka never become sympathetic or emotional to sell out your life you have better things to do kick them with a double the force whoever it may be in the world whether the things are beings or whoever else you know we can never allow the divinity within us to express and manifest which is the highest crime we can do in life suppressing depressing repressing and not at all allowing the bhagwan to express through us who is so trying himself to express there is no higher crime than this bhagwan wants to express through us first he wants to give his anubhuti to us experience to us then he wants to make us his instrument and he wants to achieve such a glorious things in the world like arjuna ke dwara bhagwan wants to establish dharma he wants to remove all the negative forces like duryodhana di this will become sentimental and emotion he says main nahi karunga ab kitni beizzati ho gayi hogi bhagwan krishna ko us situation ko dekhkar not only beizzati he just his whole plan chopad ho gaya उनको इतना गुस्सा आ गया कि गेहूं अच्छे गाली कि क्लाइपियम मास मका मका नहीं तो तो ये इतना गाले तो नपुंसक तो क्या करने बैठ गया दैट बर्ड शोस हाउ मच ही वाज फ्रस्ट्रेटेड दैट इज स्टूपिड फेलो इज नॉट अलोइंग माय ग्रेस टू फंक्शन फॉर द एस्टैब्लिशमेंट ऑफ धर्म हा इट इज अ ह्यूमिलिएशन टू द डिविनिटी इन अस इफ यू डोंट अलो दैट टू एक्सप्रेस एंड व्हाट इज दैट just sympathetic emotional loosening of all capacities that sympathy is toward the worldly things and beings more than that towards our own stupid mind and senses and ego and our desires and vasana so talking in the language of oh enjoy nahi kiya to kaisa unke sath gaya nahi to kaisa thoda zyada khaye to kya farak padta ek ghanta so hi gaya hu itna mehnat kiya na zindagi mein these are the nonsensical rakshasik emotional thoughts which always weaken us you know the jo uh, drugs drinks ke karan jo maska cheska chadta hai lekin sara energy jo khatam hota hai na these are the subtle drugs etc these emotions and thoughts uh, which always weaken us and the weakening level uh, they bring us to is to such a level that we think that we cannot do anything as spirituality that's why people don't come to classes dam nahi hai himmat nahi hai taakat nahi hai because to come to the class continuously listening that manliness is not there sold out to the worldliness in the way, with emotions even when i say this if they listen that so again at that time also their emotions backed by the ego tries to justify and go more away from the shastra they never become intelligent that is the meaning of being sold out by the maya in the form of emotions the one who recognizes this uh, he starts helping himself you know we are sympathetic to ourselves we are emotional to ourselves which ourselves the dirty stupid useless fellow with all the negative goals with all the negative values etc like the children do all nonsense and they want sympathy from mother and mother is equally beaukoop because she gave that for birth to that fellow na she also become dono satyanash milkar is it not we do that only a guru shastra doesn't give that charge they will kick only as it everywhere to say just shut up of all this emotions etc use the emotions toward the lord feel that way hey bhagwan i have not used my time resources to reach you to worship you to serve you to know you recognize you is tarah ka use karo emotion not through the world and to yourself यो हम ईश्वरता प्राप्य स्त्री गोखरवज्जिता बिकॉज ऑफ मई ओन सेंटिमेंटल इमोशनल 
so many things sentimental emotional is one he she came from swarga she loved me she liked me she spent such a time with me so all these sentiments made him so much slave to her so far now when she is leaving and going he is frustratingly running behind her getting left and right kicks this is the total patanam buddhinashat pranashyati dhyayato vishayan pamsa right from the beginning we are very careful and this contemplation this thinking this ruthless rejection of that which weakens us which pulls us down is the minimum price we have to pay even to stand as a human being then the further goals of trying to divineize our personality every day every moment with every effort for that we have come no lesser than that for that every sacrifice we should be ready to every tapasya we should be ready to everything to be given up we should be ready to that's called heroism that's what the lords guru see and they tane ho jate hain not that anything coming me coming slow to them and crying with emotion mai kya karu it was so good mai kya karu do forced me mai kya karu mujhe wo acha lag raha hai mai kya karu mai kuch nahi kar sakta नालायक नाले में गिरो गिरे हुए हो दैट विल बी टोल्ड इन द नेक्स्ट टू नेक्स्ट लोक नाले के कीड़े मकोड़े ही टेल्स टू हिमसेल्फ एंड ऑल ऑफ अस दैट वर्ड इज गोइंग टू कम बी रेडी टू फेस दैट्स व्हाई आई एम एंजॉइंग दिस चैप्टर बिकॉज इसमें सारा जो भी निकालना निकाल सकते ज्ञान भी सब कुछ भी इज अ फ्री चैप्टर इन विच वी कैन एनालाइज द एक्सपीरियंसेस and come out with the wisdom and joy joy of wisdom wisdom of joy realize karke then never ever allowing us to fall back ya smartasya kovidam rigmam then murkham panditam aninam dekho jab sab murakh kehte hain khud ko pandit manna ye sabse murkhta hai even jab sab pandit kehte hain yet discovering whether we are pandit or not if we know that we are murkha knowing that we are murkha is more wisdom we are all murkha if we are not aiming at paramatma simple definition jada bhi nahi hai is your goal bhagwan or is your life increased in only in sadhana you are would be pandit on the way in the making no 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 my goal is world prabhans and also you don't know swartha so artha you don't know therefore you are thinking mad pandit but you are murkha very intricate thoughts are there some of them which i tried yesterday towards the end but not fully succeeded in conveying that is all our, our, our outer achievements he took the pride of them he thought nothing will happen to him when he gets friendly with urvashi forgot that none of those achievements will help him when he will go through that dukha when she kicks him and goes away that attachment ka dukha he never thought no that dukha see when the people whom we love they leave us and go that dukha we any amount of money paid any amount of thing done you cannot free yourself from only the wisdom will help and wisdom delayed is wisdom denied like justice delayed is justice denied on time it should be ho gaya ye shlok ka pura rasa aswadan ho gaya aur chahiye to thoda vichar kar lena now yesterday we took the another shlok ha वेरिन वैसा सेवतो वर्ष पूगान में ऊर्वश्या अधरा सवम न तो न तृप्यते आत्मभूह कामह वह निराहुते वेर यथा नो दिस इज अ नेकेड फैक्ट दिस इज अ बिटर फैक्ट एंड ट्रुथ लेट अस कंज्यूम इट द मोर बिटर थिंग्स वी टेक द मोर डायबिटीज वी आर फ्रीड फ्रॉम द डायबिटीज ऑफ अटैचमेंट्स राग एटसेट्रा which look sweet but destroy every organ mithaiya itre meethe the khane ke time pura sharir ko satyanash karte so to all our ragas our emotions look sweet but they destroy the purushartha vyakti in us they wouldn't allow us to do sadhana these are the bitter goliya humko khana hai ayurved wale very important this topic what is the essence of this shloka मीनिंग इज सेवतो वर्ष पूगान में उर्वश आदर आसवम न तृप्यति आत्म बोहु काम द कामना विच इज बॉर्न इन मयोन अंतकर्ण इज नेवर गेटिंग सैशिएटेड इवन फॉर सो मेनी सो मेनी सो मेनी इयर्स आई वाज इंडलजिंग विथ उर्वशी दिस इज द थॉट 
and then vaknihi ahubitti biryatha is the example of the fire never gets quenched when the ahutis are going on being added this trick of the mind uh, creating desire telling us ye fulfill karo baad mein nahi hoga karke we get defeated again and again only by stopping it that we rise above it we transcend it else the more we involve the causes for creating desire vasanas become more and more stronger only up to that extent whatever little bit wisdom we have that is covered only to that extent we continue more strongly to be weak person as well as foolish person simple calculation every desire fil- desire fulfillment is making us more foolish and more weakened if you can catch this then do the antidote of that then we will succeed what is the success of it every desire not fulfilled but reason above strengthens us and makes our intellect a little sharper and subtler and it is a greater achievement for a samsari the achievements are in fulfilling desire for a sadhaka the achievements are in suppressing desire in supplementing the desire sorry suppl- sublimating the desire first to suppress then sublimate then transcending the desire only suppression will not help sublimate with intellection yesterday I, i slept less and did sadhana so that i did suppressingly but sublimate it by today's understanding therefore it was good i could use time for sadhana why it didn't happen anything to me so i can do it it's good for me in this way self justification of not fulfilling his desire as it was done earlier self justification of the benefits gained out of coming out of this desire if you do it you become more confident more heroic to do such things more and more if not the biggest problem we should remember is what na trupyati atma bhuhu kama the trupti will never come in our mind of fulfilling the kamana by fulfilling them as many number of lives we live uska kabhi nahi ant hota that's called power of maya and we said yesterday if it is now then only it is if it is here then only it is if you postpone it to the next moment then we have lost the game and in spiritual sadhana although we listen about giving up once for all and sitting with tapasya like great great yogis aisa nahi hota every time the tough battle happens many times the desire wins sometimes we win let the battle go on our aim is only to win the battle with kamana not by fulfilling it by transcending thoda bahut zyada thoda karte 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 my capacity you know the one who joins the boxing wrestling in the first thing first bout he will be knocked out only in the first blow but slowly gather strength slowly 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 he at least withstands for one or two rounds who knows later on now you see all the small cricket teams you know like bangladesh and afghanistan these are all bachcha log 40 50 pe all out hote the itni pitai hoti thi but they went on practicing practicing now they defeat big teams also cricket hum baat kare see any place any sport this is how yes we get defeated defeat getting defeated is not a problem the problem is when you stop fighting you know when you stop equipping yourself to fight for victory that conscious thought entertained always that i have to fight out my kamana not to fulfill but to transcend it not to get indulged this thought of fighting and winning that spirit if we maintain we may get defeated never mind but slowly the strength starts happening with every defeat you get in your and your ideas and slowly we will you know, once we may win but another time we may lose never mind keep on mujhe mere andar ke man ke kamnaon ko jeetna hai pehle is statement ko pakka karo pehle usse compromise nahi hona there after then how many number of time the power of maya the power of devata the power of indriya the power of vasanas the power of vishevasu the power of the people around the power of the particular timings called as kali yuga ye sab milkar like that abhimanyu is defeated they will defeat us again and again never mind never give up the goal slowly we from 100% defeats we start winning 
टू परसेंट थ्री परसेंट दिस इज वॉट वी हैव हैव फाइनली वन द डिजायर एंड रीच परमात्मा हैव डन इट और नेट किसी को नहीं होता सारे मन वासनाओं को नियंत्रण करके ऊपर उठने के लिए लेकिन एक दिन होता है तब उससे पहले हजारों जन्म उन्होंने हाथ में लेकर उस काम को करते गया प्रॉब्लम फॉर अस इज व्हाट वी एज आई सेड नाउ सिंपथेटिक इमोशनल टू ऑल आवर लोअर लाइफ एंड फीलिंग ऑफ इनेबिलिटी विद इन आवर सेल्स नो कॉन्फिडेंस देयरफॉर नो डिजायर टू कम आउट ऑफ द डिजायर्स देयरफॉर देयर इज नो इनी स्टार्टिंग ही नहीं हो रहा है अंदर है ना how many desires last one week let us say we consciously thought of not fulfilling to rise above them sochoge na ek to nahi hoga har jagah koshish kiya desire the fulfillment ke liye hua to zyada manga nahi hua to disappoint hue lekin thought that i must conquer it very rarely even if it comes up that emotion of the mind says chobai abhi kya zabar pe jaldi baazi hai abhi 10 janam ke baad dekhenge let us enjoy this 10 janam this type of emotion this type of wrong thinking will shut our the mana or the intellect which was telling us ki is bar hum indulge nahi hoenge that is the beginning and one commits for one week mithaiya nahi khaunga but after eight days some temptation comes he eats it woman he eats it then again anyway kha liya na aur 10 din ke liye but keep the thought in the mind no no i have to be permanently rising above all my slavery to any of the lower equipments and the world outside which are expression of maya then only my dukkha will stop after that to the sukha prapti for sukha prapti i have to do my spiritual sadhana of discovering myself this is what we have to catch from this particular portion and the main thought never in the delusion that my fulfilling desires the desires will end up. so take the raja yeah the example pururava ka example ki kitne saalon saalon mein indulge karta gaya but still na trupya thi that is the power of maya you know intellect is not used na trupya thi jisne gaya hi nahi us taraf he is a wisest person gaya but ek do baar mein trupt ho gaya at least he is wise at that time he is not becoming wise at that time slowly slowly he will sink it to a level where in the lives lives go for that without any trupti and why the trupti doesn't come i explain to you in the study of the earlier chapters of bhagavata and also in other texts that the, the logical fallacy is what there <coughs> the desires are in the mind the objects are outside the mind's status is different subtle Object state is different. Grasa. It is illogical for the outer grasa or objects to fulfill the inner subtle desires because their state is different. You understood? The inner desire cannot be fulfilled by the outer objects. Objects are gross. Desires are subtle. They were subtle desires are conquered by subtle wisdom only. not by fulfilling them through the grass desire fulfillment which that is why again and again it is coming agar khatam hota desire fulfillment enjoyment ke baad wo aana nahi chahiye na so one has to discover for oneself uh, that very subtle uh, uh, maya that is happening that we are trying to fulfill our inner desire with uh, outer uh, objects in fact fulfillment of desire is a wrong process it is illogical we should always think of rising about desire eliminating desire not allowing desire to pop up the only way is one totally involved life in parmatma that is the only way with the desire will not come then we are safe not only safe safe in a way we don't fall not only in that way because we are doing worship or upasana a lot we get bhagwan's anubhava also positive highest benefit think about it escape 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 never ever take for granted either mind or the world or the things and never ever imagine that i am wise i can stop with one or two pegs oh hota nahi we'll go on involving energy and one day i told you in 7 8 months back if you remember it in one of the discussion we had ki desires are not problem okay desire fulfillment is not problem what's problem is 
when the desires crop up when we fulfill the desire listen carefully the next sentence the desiring nature which enters into us that is a problem you understand desiring nature kamana ka abhyas wo kya karega phir if not this desire because the tendency it will desire for something else is it not he is a got a desire for ice cream desire for ice cream and enjoying ice cream is not different and not a, not a bad but what happens when we keep on fulfilling the desire of ice cream it is not the problem of desire of ice cream or the ice cream itself the desiring ability and under that is the dangerous thing that habit what it makes us tomorrow it will desire for some other cream day after for something else is tarah se the life becomes kamana yukta कुछ ना कुछ कामना ही मन में दैट्स व्हाट इज एट प्रेजेंट आवर स्टेट ऑफ माइंड इज इट नॉट डिजायर निद्रा डिजायर टीवी डिजायर फोन वी आर नॉट डिजायरिंग वन थिंग बट वी आर गोइंग ऑन डिजायरिंग वन और द अदर थिंग दैट इज अ डेंजरस थिंग दैट हैबिट डेवलप्स इनसाइड अस दैट्स ऑल सुबह उठते ही कोई ना कोई कामना और सोने तक कोई ना कामना और जिंदगी भर उसको पूर्ति करना ही चल रहा है ना वानो इज इंडल इन काम एंड अर्थ हाउ कैन यू थिंक अबाउट धर्म एंड मोक्ष एंड इज फाइनल लॉट इज लाइक दिस विल बी किक्ड बाय ओनली जिस उर्वशी को वैल्यू देके अपने आप को इतना नीच निकमी ना बनाया दैट उर्वशी ओनली विल किक एंड प्रूव दैट यू आर रियली नीच कमीने व्हाट इज द लेसन उर्वशी टार्ट बाय किकिंग हिम यू नो that you have valued me stupid fellow you should have valued bhagwan <laughs> i told the example of tulsidas and all exhaustively we saw this topic satisfactorily we have seen we are very lacking in our other shastra dhyanam and deep thinking isliye utna aur bataye nahi honge but jitna ho sakta hai we are trying to discuss now sevata varsha pugan mein purva sha hadra savam na trupyate atma bhu kamah bhagnihi ahuti viryatha Clear. Now comes the most dangerous shloka, the next one. Dangerous and beautiful. Dono hai. First line is as dangerous as the second line as great. In this shloka, his vairagya viveka is becoming parakasta. At the same time, his uh, understanding of the solution also come to parakasta level. Parakasta is supreme. Okay. Now listen carefully the shloka. then the literal meaning and to the extent possible analysis of it he says pum shalya pahrutam chittam kon vanyo mochitum prabhu atma rameshwaram rude bhagavantam adhokshaja pum shalya pahrutam chittam kon vanyo mochitum prabhu atma rameshwaram rude bhagavantam adhokshaja so total meaning of shloka try to catch then the analysis of first line then analysis of second line the total meaning of shloka is mai chitta is apahruta noted by that kumshali urvashi apahruta is kidnapped now who is there to free mai chitta which is kidnapped by that kumshali urvashi other than atma rama ishwaram the ishwara of the atma rama gnanis who is he bhagavantam parmatma krishna adhoksha jaha who always has his drishti of krupa karana on all of us this is a literal meaning bhagwan adhoksha ja jo atma rama muniyon ke ishwar hai unke alawa mera chit jisko ye punchali ne kidnap kiya usko chuda sakta hai so the kidnap disk story <laughs> apakruta I know kidnap ke story sir so much children are kidnapped anything that goes on happening in the world my rachitta pumshali ke dwara abharut kiya gaya aap iska na main mochit kar sakta hu na koi duniya ke aur log sirf bhagwan now this is and there are very many things in this to discuss hundreds of them i'll be not doing all that thoda thoda hi why only bhagwan in this particular case for one reason that 
that kidnapper is so powerful but the second reason is the issue is such a bad one can you share it with others if you share with others instead of giving help and sympathy they will kick you with all abuses saying that itne bade raja ban kar sharam nahi aata to kaise apne dimag ko se lootne diya no main bata raha hu very sense ye jo issues episodes hote hai na you cannot take anybody's help also for for, for that therefore nobody's help you can take who else is there bhagwan alone is there because he is the only one with whatever thousands of mistakes we have done a pap and other mistakes of forgetting him yet he goes on forgiving us and he starts helping us that is possible only to the bhagwan nobody else therefore only adokshya can help us nobody means nobody in the world किसे बोल भी सकते हैं आप ना बेशरम की बात है वो आई एम लॉस्ट इन माई डिजायर फुलफिलमेंट ड्रामा एंड नाउ द फुलफिलमेंट इज नॉट हैपनिंग यू नो वाई द ओल्ड पीपल आर सो फ्राउनिंग फ्रस्ट्रेटेड फेस बिकॉज ऑल द लस्ट एंड पैशन एंड डिजायर एंड ऑल द भोग प्रवृत्ति ना किसे बोल नहीं सकते ना उसको छोड़ नहीं सकते ना भोग कर सकते अब भगवान के प्रति भक्ति नहीं है ऑल दैट इज शोन ऑन द फेस इन द फॉर्म ऑफ दैट फनी रिंकल्स दैट रेडनेस ऑफ द आईज द रेडनेस ऑफ द नोज एंड सच ए पैथेटिक फेस कि मरना चाहते मर भी नहीं सकते जी ना चाहते हैं जी का फायदा नहीं है जी को यू अंडरस्टैंड व्हिच इज द वर्स्ट केस ऑफ ए फेल्ड लाइफ फुलफिलमेंट ऑफ लाइफ ऐसा नहीं होता by age of 45 50 all done kicked off within next by 10 years grown so much with detachment and spiritual sadhana the whole life is bubbling with the divinity ye hai zindagi banane wala humko not the other one still new new objects are coming of the world ab wo nahi mila mujhe ye nahi mila maine wo enjoy nahi kar paya that buddha doesn't say with the mouth he need not say his wishes everything not only grass objects of eating drinking even the little higher things ki my children have not done namaskar to me my grandchildren did not enquire about me all this nonsense is also desire only because of that also we become go kharavat not outside inside only and how much of the issues created out of that and he tells the wife dekho aaj pota ne bola hi namaskar she says mere ko bhi nahi kiya dono gade ye baat kar rahe hain about that nonsense kya fark padta hai that stupid fellow says or not says but we are slave to that we are afraid that we should be recognized we should be respected we should be valued we should be you know our presence should be acknowledged ye sab slavery hai इसलिए बता रहा ना एक नहीं हजारों हजारों रस्सिया घसीट कर ओनली वन उर्वशी कॉट दट उर्व रमा फॉर अस एक्सेड उर्वशी मिलियन ऑफ रंबा के मेंदका एंड तिलोत्तमा ऑल ऑफ देम कॉट अस दीज आर ऑल दोज ओनली यू नो दैट इंडियन स्टूपिड ट्रेडिशन ऑफ है ना सेवेंटी पचास साल हो गए शादी होके and still this stupid damad who's age is 75 has demands again from the in-laws that wife the one who gave the his daughter to his wife he has become 80 years marne wala hai phir bhi uske samne ja kar rob jabana diwal ke din ki tumne is saal mere ko kapde nahi diye what is slavery it is it is not commanding the father and it's a slavery <laughs> to your own mind i'm just telling how we have to call out the example samples in our life which are making us go khara and who is miserable there it is you in your own mind <laughs> that he has not called me did not reward me this time you is it not i am the elder son in law and the second daughter of him got married chota son in law aaya and he is more wiser than a higher post than me then he will be loved respected more than me stupid fellow then misery only you can see on the face so to the daughter sinla me badi bahu ve choti wale aayegi to wo jyada important di jayegi are nay nay shaadi ho raha hai unka sambandh se establish hona hai naturally let them do no na the poisonous seed is sown which slowly becomes a tree giving only poisonous fruits 
how many millions of examples we are conquered by the habits of teas and coffees the habits of tvs and cell phones the habits of walkings and sleepings the habits of the friends and enemies the habits of the worldliness everything has enslaved us gross urbans and subtle emotions inside wrong expectations wrong identity itself is wrong murakh other than aham brahmasmi every identity is wrong and having identity and claiming to be great in that and want others to recognize main bada minister ho main bada police officer ho army you are telling by saying that you are minister or police officer that you are not brahman you respect only brahman not any police officer any minister respect me but you are retired so what i did so many years so i was thinking when the new president comes sir what will happen to the ramanath who enjoyed five years kuch nahi koi puchega hi nahi baaki sab vaham hi hai ab jo aane wali hai unka kya hoga panch saal rahenge so what uske baad kabhi bahut punya kiya hoga itne bada desh ka wo panch saal president rahenge so what one way it is so great if you look from one side but otherwise question is what with that post what service i did to my nation and what sadhana i have done to me and that works only when we have humbleness not arrogance that is another topic but add it to this how many types of things are we are caught up in this world everything everything this i this so much and we don't even aware of, we are not even aware of it you know when you go for a test every part of the body has a problem we are gone for not gone for the test koi log darte hai isliye jaanch karao to sab pata chalega isme karunga hi nahi aur mari jate ek din till the death something or the other of the body goes on troubling wo jhelta rahega lekin test kara ke apne aap ko theek nahi karta same way we are suffering every moment in our mind and life not wanting to test where we are going wrong and how to treat and we are going wrong only in the getting sold to urvashi in one or the other form and again i am repeating 12th time urvashi means every involvement every endeavor every indulgence where paramatma is not there that is urvashi kuch bhi ho shivaya bhagwan ke chintan ka sab urvashi that in bhajagovindam called as dukram karane only there are two things in life bhajagovindam or dukram karane paramatma dhyanam or urvashi dhyanam <laughs> now one by one thing we understand of this shloka pumshalya apahrutam chittam first the chitta is looted by pumshali that pumshali is a very worst word pumshali is a, the one who never sticks to one man who goes on jabbing that's why i said she is not a wife she is only pumshali that is how she is they are like that that's what their profession and anybody is more attractive or more money giving or more valuing respecting or they like more they kick the earlier fellow and go no apply this thought entirely ki the prakriti will not stay with any individual like this president post of president is a pumshali only post time telling it won't be to now the vice president he was having so many expect me banunga mai banunga he just kept aside only somebody new given now if is wise enough he say thank god at least a vice president banao mai nahi to rota rahega mere ko banne nahi diya banaye nahi that post is bhumishali bhai kisko varan karegi nahi bol sakte aap and who deserves at what time and how it have only the lord knows वो कहा से कोई वो आकर कहा बैठेंगे नहीं पता सीन महाराष्ट्र वॉट इल है विच पार्टी विल चेंज क्या वो मिक्सअप होगा कौन बनेगा नहीं पता दे मे कम टूगेदर दे गेट अलेंड विद बीजेपी और दे टेक सम ऑफ दी एम एल एस बइंग क्या करेंगे नहीं पता द माया कैन बी दैट इज सम रॉन्ग अलेंज द अदर वे टू टेक बदल आई कैन ज्वाइन एंड दे मे बिकम चीफ मिनिस्टर पुनश्चली है वो That's what we have to see in this world. कोई भी कहीं कुछ ठिकता नहीं है 
ఐ కెనాట్ ట్రస్ట్ మై బాడీ ఇట్స్ పూన్స్ టెలింగ్ ఆజ్ హెల్దీ రాయగా కల్ నైర్ ఆగా ఆజ్ శక్తి రాయితే కల్ నైర్ అయితే ఆజ్ యంగ్ అయ్యి కల్ బుడా అవుజాయిగా యూ ట్రస్ట్ హర్ అండ్ దెన్ యూ యూ వీ ట్రస్ట్ హర్ ఆర్ దట్ వన్ దెన్ వీ గెట్ చీటెడ్ పూమ్స్ టెలి ఈజ్ ఎ వర్స్ట్ వర్డ్ యూజ్డ్ టు టెల్ దిస్ ఆస్పెక్ట్ ఆఫ్ వేద అంత ది ప్రపంచ ఈజ్ చెంచల్ ఈజ్ ఇట్ నాట్ నాట్ ఓన్లీ ద మన ఈజ్ చెంచల్ బట్ జగత్ ఆల్సో ఈజ్ నిరంతర చేంజింగ్ ఇట్ ఈస్ ఈజ్ నాట్ స్టేయింగ్ ద సేమ్ వే ఇట్ గోస్ ఆన్ చేంజింగ్ that is a meaning here that is its nature don't blame the nature you know the flower is so beautiful in the morning by evening it's faded away so you can't scold the flower that is the punmushtala of the flower that it's not so beautiful like in the morning by the time it becomes evening but that is its nature the prakriti ka nature yahi hai ki koi purush ke vas thikta nahi hai you know that the and the women called fortune or all that she goes on shifting from one to the other now see the contradiction in him he says this pomishali then how did you allow your mind to be looted by her that is the moha that is the murkata she acted to be trustworthy or loving but where did your dimag go why didn't you think about there is a beautiful part of purura wise word after getting a biggest kick of his life now at least he is becoming wise we have to learn this only the question is not how much he was kicked by urvashi and all that the question is did he realize from it and came out or not he realized and came out that's why his story which is worst still became a great important topic of bhagavata that also in mukti skanda that also towards the end that is the greatness of our shastras they give this story to teach us that he conquered he became victorious we can also and the last victory is reaching the spiritual self a before victory is doing only spiritual sadhana like that there are various levels of victories but the first victory is using the intellect analyzing the situations finding where we went wrong and correcting it there and not repeating again this is the first victory that is the glory of him towards the end we will see the urashi kikri man went away he did not go to ramba and menaka tilottama that is achievement else he will repeat again she will also run away then another purura upakyana we will say are bevakuf seeko ek cheez se bas that's it you understand the one who learns from one mistake or misery is the wisest one the one who repeatedly committing same mistake and yet not learning is the most unfortunate fellow cursing himself that is called as murkham pandita marini okay we have explained pumshali word now second pumshalya apahrutam manah so it is a blemish blame given to her but the mistake is ours to kehta itna veer hai shaktishali hai how did you allow your mana to be looted by her na like tum itna akal mand ho to bachana hai na apne dimag ko kaise apne chitt ko usse lootne diya how did you allow no in this regard only whenever we meet the youngsters who are going to hostels or colleges or on job to other country we talk only this stuff same thing here what is that beta anybody wants your money you give anybody wants your objects you give anybody wants you to give some time to help them do that any seva you do all you do but don't give your chittam to anybody your chitta is only for your job to your parents your own spiritual sadhana this is a standing order we give whether they receive it or not because when the chitta is given to something or being or body life is destroyed that life is gone that's it but unfortunately they don't catch the essence of it many of them they get lost sab kuch kisi ko de do apne dimag kisi ko nahi dena sirf usko bhagwan ko hi dena hai are you understanding everything given but chitta is not given still you are safe whether the other things given or not if the chitta is given to anything other than bhagwan the life is gone chitta is the thought flow
तुम शल्या बहुतम चित्त शिल्ले की गई मेरे चित्त को वो कोई ले नहीं जाता मेरा दिल लूटा है तुमने कोई लूटता नहीं तुम लुटाते हो बेवकूफ यू हैव टू डिस्कवर इट नो बडी लूट सीट है वी ओनली लुटाओ इंग्लिश आल्सो हिंदी आल्सो मेरा लूट लिया मेरा दिल टूट गया हाँ हाँ सी दिस पैथेटिक लाइफ ऑफ दिल ले गए दिल टूट गए मिजरेबल वेर इज दिस लोएस्ट लाइफ द कॉन्ट्रडिक्शन दी the contrast of it uh, where is the life that of spiritual sadhanas one after other doing and conquering one after other upadis and excelling in one after other steps of meditation wo ka hai ye ka hai dono manush ko sambhav hai so instead of doing this one if that we are doing whom to blame and that's what we went on doing so far in so many lives ab is janam mein to akal aa jaye na हम तो यही चाह रहे हैं भाई जिंदगी खत्म होने से पहले ऐसा अकल आ जाए सिवाय भगवान का हमारा कहीं दृष्टि होना ही नहीं इंक्लूडिंग सत्संग बाजी फ्रस्ट्रेटिंग थिंग दिस इज नो बडी कम नो बडी लेजेंस नो बडी एक्टॉलेट्स नो बडी अप्रिशिएट्स यूजलेस जॉब नो पेमेंट नथिंग डूइंग ओनली परमात्मा अन्वेषण and when we have to discuss these topics discuss rurava's life only toward the end if okay but think about the avadutas like bharata jada bharata like the dattatreya bhagwan like that a great rishabha deva how great they were or the devotees like the prahladas and all are yaar zindagi is tarah se mein le jana hai apna hai life apne ko jeevan ko apnana hai fir usko अपना बनाना है अच्छा बनाना सी दी फ्रस्ट्रेटिंग सॉन्ग पुमशल्यापुरथम चित्त माई माइंड इज लूटेड इसमें गाली दे रहे हो एंड दे वेरी सबलाइन थिंग विच आर वेरी पेनफुल एंड डजेंट लुक गुड टू शेयर ऑन दिस डायस they were not sharing them they are left for your own thinking <laughs> why he said that word pumshali think for yourself har cheez bolna nahi chahiye but this we can talk he is sitting and crying mai kya karu ab mere dil mere paas nahi hai ye loot kar gayi then he thought how can i free myself He found neither himself nor anybody can help him. Therefore, kaha anya ha konya ko konu anya ha mochi tum prabhu. So, pumshali we discussed. Pumshali achitta mahosam we discussed. She did not do the aparana. He only gave it her. She packed and went away. No matter. Okay. Third one, konu anya ha mochi tum prabhu. Who is the one who is capable of freeing my chitta from her? तो अगेन आई टेल यू एक बात में उसी से आप समझ जाओगे नहीं समझोगे तो घंटों समझाएंगे उसको घंटे भी समझाए बात एक ही है कि हु विल लिबरेट माय चित्ता फ्रॉम मोटिवेशन ओनली वन यू गो ऑन फोकसिंग ऑन भगवान दैट्स व्हाट वी से एनीबडी सम बिरेवमेंट हैपेंड हस्बैंड डाइड और वाइफ डाइड सो मच दुख का सो मच सिंपति वी नो इट अनबेरेबल सम बेरेवमेंट्स आर especially when they are such a close people but uh, the question asked is with all your misery can that dukkha be removed can that problem be removed can we get him back it will not and we allow yourself to continuously become miserable day by day you will increase your dukkha day by day you become weak only then what to do one amma i told when she was husband died amma i am giving you tea in my name jitna rona hai utna ro lo Asthma, child, you cry, you pull your hair, hit your head to the wall, blame all the gods. Three months I am giving you. After that, not even one thought of any of these things. Uh, you focus your full attention only on your spiritual sadhana and pray for him. You know what did she do? After one month only, one and a half month, the fourteen April, she spoke to me and said, "So, Abhiji, I started doing from last four five days." i am finding peace and i am praying for him and i am finding my sadhana also acha ho raha hai aap ye nahi batate to main soch soch ke dimag tabiyat kharab kharab karke pata nahi mera kya hota 
no when her chitta was looted by the dead person who protected her only the bhagwan pehle hi bhagwan ko pakadte hain to koi looti nahi le jayega man ko that is the intelligence ha dukh mein subhena sab kare sukh mein na kar idhar do sukh mein kare dukh hai koi that's the subtle meaning of it when we are right for a beginning giving our mana intellect to parmatma only and anybody comes give them the vyavaharik dharmik prema and seva man bhagwan ke charan mein that is called patibhratyam the spiritual patibhratyam ananyata no vyabhichara there my mind intellect is given to god i can't pull my mind from that from my god guru and shastra and give it to anyone i am with you i'll work for you madava but you can't be my goal my goal is bhagwan my means is bhagwan pehle se wo karte hain to koi kiski kaam maza la hai but urvashi any ramma anybody can come and take away also will not nobody can loot our mind if that is there you are the top most greatest person if not at least later on quickly take shelter of parmatma there is the only thing which will pull us out of all this dukha देखो हाथ जल गया तुरंत उसको मलहम लगाओ बट इमीडिएटली स्टार्ट टेकिंग द नेम ऑफ द लॉर्ड यू कैन सी द दुख गेट्स रिड्यूस्ड एंड दिस टू डो डे मॉर्निंग इन आवर तेलुगु विष्णु शास्त्र नाम क्लास 15 मिनट्स वी एक्सप्लेन द लक्की फेलोस केम टुडे 28 30 पीपल वर देयर ऑन YouTube कितने देर टाइम बैठे आई डोंट नो व्हाट वाज द वर्ड यूज्ड द Pramodana, that there was the name of the Lord explained. Dhyana matre na dhyata ar bhakta naam pramodayati. Kewal dhyana karne se pramodayate hai, is there unke naam pramodana. He said, just remember me, focus your attention, I'll take care of you. Dhyana matre na. Just to unke taraf dhyana. Ajin dhagmar var dhyana, unse hat kar jagat ke taraf hai. Isle fasi ja raha hai. we explained so exhausted in morning all hindi people learn telugu and listen vishnu sahas naam ek ek naam kya maza aa raha hai i am to reveling and enjoying yesterday only three names i could do today also only two or three that much maza aa usme like our these mantras also and now when the urvashi took away the mana what to do request her tell her or if nothing is possible two options are there either kill her or kill yourself this is what everybody does not pururava that is why pururava is a hero in spite of such a worst fellow in his life earlier because of this one episode and what did he do because of which he became hero that is the second line in fact from the first line the second part only he understood nan can free his mind which is captured or kidnapped by urvashi other than atma rama ishwaram bhagavantam adokshacha because this power of kamana desire is so much only one thing is more powerful than that is parmatma because all the power of kamana is that of maya और माया के ऊपर कौन है सिर्फ मायापति परमात्मा ही है बाकी सब माया के अधीन में है स्टेयर फॉर ओनली अधोक्ष भगवान एंड व्हाट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ आत्मा राम ईश्वरम व्हाट इज मीनिंग ऑफ पुरुषम भगवंतम अधोक्ष जम ऑल दोज वर्ड्स वी मस्ट अंडरस्टैंड एंड व्हाट इज इंटेंडेड इन हिम ओके इंटेंशन इन हिज माइंड थोड़ा इंपॉर्टेंट श्लोक देन ई कम्स टू लिटिल मोर हायर अंडरस्टैंडिंग दैट Urva she is not so bad in the sense that she did not cheat as I was thinking. She in fact alerted, hinted me right from the beginning. First of all, she took puts her conditions, and then those conditions, as long as they were fulfilled, she was honestly only with me. Then when the conditions were unfulfilled, then she was honest to her own conditions. Therefore, she left. therefore she is not to be blamed and the best thing what urvashi did to pururava while living was she gave him such a life long lesson and that lesson which she gave him is not there in this 
11th skanda 26th chapter but it is there in the 9th skanda 14th chapter referring that story tomorrow we will explain all that when he says bodhitasya api devyame that devi has done all the bodhana to me still i was such a murakh i did not understand it and what bodha she gave is very essential in this sense every disappointing detaching or what is it disappointing and ditching and cheating person or experience of the world is a devi to do us a bodha bodha is awakening every frustrating disappointing experience of the world is nothing but paramatma in that form making us awaken and awakening is only one thing awakening for the permanent or the truth if you are not awakened to permanent and truth we have not awakened that in vivek chodaman is called as nidritavat prajalpa he is talking on but he is not talking sense at all then if he is talking but not talking sense means what he is talking in sleep means he has not waken up woken up you know neend mein bolte jaate hain haste hain rote hain chillate hain bulate hain kisi ko do you see that that's called nidritavat prajalpa he is doing talking but he is not waken up so here bodhita means what bodhita only to paramatma other than that anything is you are not woken up you are still blabbering in sleep only here the sleep of ignorance try to catch this is a very tough topic subject elaborate this can be concluded in 3 days also by just telling story to you and urvaji left and he cried and he sang the song of detachment thus by god's grace he turned toward paramatma god bhagwan and as a result as a continuation of this story bhagwan also told udhaji beta therefore sadhu aise hote hain satsang aise hote hain isliye dussang chhod ke satsang bhagna chalo let us go to 27 chapter the kriya yoga i can do that <laughs> But these four or five chapters ke baad to ho jayega ek skandam. Then twelve skandam don't have that many Vedantic knowledges and all. Ya miss ho gaya to aur kai mile. Aur itna, ye to amare se related hai. Every day some Urvashi is ditching us, taking our mind. How important it is for us. And all said and done, in spite of I speaking to you, you listening to me, what works is, how seriously I took it to myself, that helps me. helps me how seriously you took it to yourself that helps you isliye zindagi mein kahin na kahin humko serious sincere hona hai aur isse badhkar aur ek topic nahi hai aur ek mauka nahi hai aur ek samay nahi this is the best topic best opportunity best time <laughs> recognize it you and me let us not allow our chitta to be looted by anything or being or project other than parmatma इच्छा बढ़ाते जाओ परमात्मा को पाने का इंक्रीज द डिजायर टू नो द लॉर्ड रीच द लॉर्ड सर्व द लॉर्ड वर्शिप द लॉर्ड वो आर डूइंग दैट 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 इट्स डिफिकल्ट एवरीथिंग इज डिफिकल्ट वर्ल्ड आल्सो वाज डिफिकल्ट अर्लीयर यू मेड इट इजी ठीक है ओम पूर्णमद पूर्णमिदम पूर्ण पूर्णमुदच्यते पूर्णस्य पूर्णमादाय पूर्णमेव अवशिष्यते ओम शांति 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 हरि ओम श्री गुरुभ्यो नमः परमनुषिभ्यो नमः परब्रह्मणे नमः बोल कृष्ण चंद्र भगवान की जय सद्गुरुनाथ की जय चलो भाई आज रुकते हैं आई थिंक वी हैव टू डू अनदर टेक्स्ट आल्सो मैं तो आज भूल ही गया श्री राम जी की कथा है ओम नमो नारायण नमो 